Hey guys, it's Melissa. Um, today we're gonna do a full body strength workout. So you do need a mat or a towel or something soft surface. Um, you need a pair of medium to heavier dumbbells, two of them, and then you need just one light dumbbell. You could totally get away with the, um, not using the light and using the medium to heavy for that movement as well. But just in case you get tired. Um, I am gonna be going, we're gonna be going 40 seconds um, 10 second rest in between. We're going to take it four times through. So you have two movements um, and we'll rotate through them. A lot of it's right side, left side. So that's why we're going four times. And we have four total sets. All right, let's get it on. <laughs> All right, just start with those feet hip width apart. Come down, tap that toe. Stop in those knees. Give me two more. Last one. Pick it up, little arm circles, palms are facing down here. And take your palms up, take it back. And swing it out. And give me those knee hugs to pull that knee into that chest. Waking up the hamstring and that glute. Two more. Last one. Fingers now go up to your tibbles. Step your elbows together. Open them nice and wide. Look at them. Squeeze your shoulder blades together. Two more. Last one. Go ahead and come to that squat next. And keep them apart. Shoulders back. Squat it out. Our punch train on no movement to those heels. The bolt into the floor. One more. Take that marching reach. Arms are straight up. Put that leg up. I'm gonna pull those arms back. Look at that range of motion. Two more. Last one. Take it out to the side. Right side lunge. One more to the right, and send it to your left. Gonna short back, pull those boots back. Give me one more, and then let's get boogie. All right, so our first two movements. You're gonna need your medium to heavier dumbbells on this one. So you have a split lunge, with the overhead press. So arms gonna actually stay straight up. I'm gonna show you sideways. Arms gonna stay straight up. You're gonna step that right leg back. You're gonna come down and up, just in that split lunge, holding that weight up, all right? We'll do right side, left side. Then you're gonna pick up your other dumbbell. You're gonna bring up your right leg, and you have our balanced bicep curl as your second movement. I we still do that one? Right side, left side too. All right, so let's get it going. Right arms up. Left leg's back. I mean, right leg's back. Right arms up. I can get it right. <laughs> right here, going in three, two, and let's go. Take it back. We're going straight down, press back up, holding that weight up. We're going to keep those shoulders stacked over top of those hips, so no lean. Engage that core, embrace it. You got 10 tiny seconds here, you got it. One more, one more. And bring it up, nice job. Grab that other weight. We're gonna take your right leg up this first time. 
Ready in three, two, take it up, roll it out. So lots of ways to challenge your balance here, all right? You guys can give me that little kickstand. All right, if your balance is not there today, it's okay. Just tap that foot down. Otherwise, keep it pulled up. Make it a little bit harder by bringing that knee up. Just keep it curling, keep it curling. If you wibble wobble, it's okay. Almost there. One more curl. And switch sides, nice job. All right, now left arms up, left legs back. Enjoy your 10 seconds, but get yourself set. Ready? Wait up and let's go. Take it down and up. We're gonna try to work on getting your knee to track out towards your pinky toe. We often come here, keep it straight. And keep getting it low. Wanna feel those legs burn it. Woo! Almost there, almost there. One more. And bring it up. Nice job. Alright, balance bicep curl, left legs up this time. Ready? Now let's take it. Let's get that left leg is up. Soften in that right leg. And breathe it out. Concentrate a full range of motion on those bicep curls. Under 10. We got three, two, bring it down. Nice job. All right, we can do it all again. Right side, right legs back, right arms up, and let's go. And we're extend all the way over the top. Push through those legs. Feel that shoulder pressure as you hold that dumbbell. Ten seconds. Last one. And bring that other weight in. Awesome work. Right legs up. Steady it. And let's go, curl it. And this is your time, your workout. Listen to your body. If you need to take that toe down, take it down. Give me your kickstand instead. Breathe in it. Let that left booty burn. You got 10 seconds. One more. And take it down. Nice job. Woo. All right, left leg up, back, left arm up. Ready, set it. And let's go. You're gonna adjust yourself where you need to. You're never stuck. Keep getting it low. Woo! Went for a run this morning. My legs are feeling it. 10 seconds. Left leg is up, of course. 
steady it. Ready? And let's go. Curl it. You might have a better side. This is definitely not my best side. <laughs> You'll see me wibble wobble more. Almost there. Remember, we're looking for good reps here. 10 seconds. One more. And rest. Nice job. Woo! Let me grab my towel. <clears throat> Still humid here in Virginia. <laughs> All right, next up. Okay, I need your mat now. We're gonna start off. I'm sorry we do it a lot, but I love them, all right? The chest press and bridge. <laughs> They're so good for you. Lay your heavy weight in the shirt here. Lay it down. Hips up. Fall straight down the knees. And you're giving that chest press. All right? Second movement. You need one down though. Really right side, left side. You'll be in your bare position. So back is flat, legs at 90. You're gonna come through, take that weight, press it up, and then back. Alright? So you rotate, open, hold, and press. Alright? If you want to use your lighter dumbbell for that one, if that press is too much for you, take it down that one. Alright? Alright, otherwise let's get going. Just press and bridge. It's happening in three. And let go. Here, hit her up, squeeze it. Then we're breathe through this movement. Try to tap and then you exhale the top. Hips are back up. You got three. Two, bring you down. One weight. We're going to be on the right hand. Fair position. Ready? Hip stop. I mean, knees up and let's go. Rotate, open, press. So twist. That right heel should come down. Stabilize yourself and press up. Almost there. Okay, one more. And bring it down. Awesome work. Back in that chest, press and bridge. Take it down. Hips up. And time to go. Now control that weight. Those dumbbells will be a top of your chest. Not your head, your chest. You got to keep pressing. Almost there. One more. Take it down. You're on the left side now. On that left side. Left hands on. Set it up. Knees up. And let's go. Rotate, open, and press. Rotate, open, and press. And we always come back to that bare position. Butt is down. We're not here, right? Keep it down. One more. And 
time. Woo! All right, round three. Let's get it. Ready. Up. And let's go. Press it. But if you have lighter dumbbells than you're normally chest pressing, look for good reps, but a little bit quicker reps. Get back up. Mine were second too. Get them up. There we go. 10 seconds here. Last one. Take it up. Right side. On that right side. Ready. Bears up. And let's go. Twist. Open and press. Keep that core engaged, that rotating through those obliques. Ten seconds here, you got it. Back to those bears. Legs at 90, knees right underneath those hips. Last one. Take it down. Woo! All right, last round on these. Cruising through it. Ready. Hips up, and let's go. All right, last bear, left side. Get it set, and let go. Rotate, press it up. You got this focus. Open, press, right back down. Almost there. Ten seconds. Your best there you have. Come on. One more. And done. Woo! Nice work. Just so you need the two heavies this time, right? No mat. Toss mine out. All right, you guys are gonna give me a deadlift to a reverse row. So feet are hip width apart. We're gonna come down, and we're gonna have our palms facing towards me. We're gonna reverse row and then come back up. All right. We're just gonna keep those palms facing towards that screen and take it up. All right. Then you're gonna give me a side lunge. This will be a right side, left side. So we're just gonna come out to the right, up. Hammer curl at the top. All right, so those are our two movements. Set yourself up, get your weights. So palms are facing towards me. It is a hit to those hips, not a squat. We're going in three, two, and let's go. Dead lift, reverse row, and up. So remember, on that dead lift, soften those knees, back is flat. So we're not coming here, right? Keeping it up. In that reverse row, elbows stay tight. Pull that weight to your belly button. Ten seconds here. And rest. Nice job. All right, bring it down by your side. Just every out to the right. Hammer around the top in three, two, and let's go. Side lunge, up, hammer curl. From that side lunge, you want to pull that bottom back. The shoulders and chest need to stay up. So we're not down here. Keep it up. You're looking forward the whole time. Just step it out wide. Work those legs. One more. 
more. And rest. Nice job. All right, let's take y'all back through. So if you need to, shake your hands out in between. Do that. You got 10 seconds. Ready. And let's go. Deadlift. Reverse row. And we're in that deadlift. Tuck your tailbone under. What do I mean there? We're not arching it here, okay? We're gonna take it forward. Roll it, protect that lower back. Thank you, squeezing them back. Yep, pulling their shoulder blades together. Almost there. And rest. Nice job. All right, we're sitting out to the left, out to the left. Hammer curl on the top. In three, two, let go. And when you come back to that stand, your feet should be about hip width apart. You're not coming all close here, right? About hip width apart. Square them off. Step it out, come on. Get it done right. Jordan's yelling at you. She knows you're cheating at lunch, come on. Under 10. Last one. And rest. Nice work. All right, we're halfway through that set. Spread those feet off, shoulders back, and let's go, head left. Go it. <laughs> They're very playful today, aren't they? I know. They even ran with me. She still has energy, guys. Constant. <laughs> Breathe it, squeeze it. Come on. Remember, tuck that tailbone under. You're arching. I can see it. Back is flat. Gonna give me one more and take it up. Nice job. Woo. All right, right side, right side, lunging it out. Ready in three, two, and let's go. Take it down. Remember, stabilize that body. It's two moments. Side lunge into your curl. We're not using that momentum here. Step it through. Shoulders back, they're locked in place. They're not moving. Almost there. Two more reps, get them in. And rest. Woo! All right, left side, here it comes. Shoulders back, chest up. And let's rock it, step it out. Keep getting it wide. Remember those glutes in your track over that back heel. Here. Last one. And take a water break. Nice work. All right, we're going to set up for our next round. 
You need one like and one of your medium to heavies. That's it. All right. And your mat. So first up, we're going to be in our kneeling side plank. So we're going to take our left knee down, right's going to extend out. This one I'm going to be today using my lighter dumbbell. So you use what you like, all right? You're going to lift up that leg. You need to keep those hips stacked, all right? You're going to rotate down. You're going to row it, extend, press, and back down. While you hold that position, extend and press, pulling this leg up. Obviously, right side, left side. Then you have a straight set up into an overhead tricep. So it's going to be straight here. Your one medium to heavy dumbbell, extend to overhead. You're going to sit it up, hold it, give your tricep, and then take it back down. All right. All right, set yourself up. This is it, last set. All right. Left knees down, right extended out. Right hands on that weight. Ready? And let go. So row it, open it, back down. The key here is to keep that leg extended. We're not rotating that hip, right? Keep it up, keeping it up. That looks good. I need my water break now. You're halfway. Ten seconds left here. Keep that leg up. One more. And take it down. Awesome work. All right, legs are straight here. Weights over top head. Sit up. Tricep in three, two, let's go. Sit it up. Hold it. Overhead try. Back down. You want to be straight up at that overhead try and roll it back down to your sit up. Up. Hold it. Tricep. Straight arm. Take it back down. And control that release down. You know that. Almost there. Last one. And take it down. Nice job. All right. Right hands down. Left hands on that weight. Left legs out. Ready, ready. And let's go. Lift it up. Rotate. Press. That weight wants to come right in between that leg and that hand, right? Right now I'm here. Release it right there. Perfect. As you're finding, <laughs> holding that leg up is a lot of work. As you move that way through. Engage, squeeze those glutes. Don't cheat it. 10 seconds. One more. And take it down. Nice work. Yeah, flying. All right, straight legs. Sitting my way now. <laughs> Break overhead in three, two, and let's go. Sit it up. Overhead drive. And then the first initial movement is through those abs as you sit up. The feet go on the spine, engage and pull. Keep it up, you're almost there. Take it back to that side plank. So this round, left hands down, right hand on that weight. Right legs up. Ready? Lift it, hold it, and let's go. Open it up. Stabilize. Engage every muscle here. You're using them all. Get 
Head back up. We don't want it down here. We want it up. Squeeze it. 10 seconds. Last one. And bring it down. Woo! All right, see what time. Set yourself up. Ready, to get those legs up. And let's go. Straight up, elbows are in for that tricep. Remember, don't pop up here. You got 10 seconds. Let's get one more in. And rest. All right. Right knees down, left hands on that weight, left leg extends out, ready, and let's go, lift. We're not routine that yet, don't drop it, keep it up, it's back to each other. Back up there. You got under 10 seconds. One more. And time. Nice job. All right. Last round of sit up. Let's go. Wait in. And let's go. I'm going to control it down. Use your strength to pull your body up to that set. Strong triceps here. Almost there. 10 times a second. Last one. And draw. Nice job. Woo! Alright, let's take it down and stretch right away. We're already sitting, so let's take it down. <laughs> Hug those knees. Rock it side to side. Massage in that lower back. Go ahead and take right leg up. Sit that left over. Hands behind that right thigh. Pull it in. You also want to be pressing away your left, right? So we're just not hanging out here, right? You want to be pulling and pressing that left leg away. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> and then go ahead and drop that right foot down. Keep it crossed. Keep it crossed. Arms up to that T and fold it over to the left. A nice final twist. Feel that hip. And bring it back to center. Let's walk out the other side. Left leg up. <laughs> right cross is over. <laughs> Welcome to my craziness, right? <laughs> Remember, pull. And then release it down. Left foot down. And you're going to fold it over to the right side. Arms out to the teacher just to brace their shoulders. You might have a side that's tighter. This is always mine. Can't even make it to the floor right now. And then roll it back up center. Let's get back up. Time to stand. All right, left arm straight across. I like my sweat stroke. <laughs> I'm gonna take it up and back. And swing it out. Hug yourself. You deserve it. Other side, straight across. And 
and up and back. And swing it out. Let's open that chest up, pull those arms back, reach it. And bring your force, put those abs in. Pull those hands away from your heart, round your back. Come up, extend up, make yourself tall, and you are a done. Awesome job today. Way to crush it. I hope you had a wonderful workout. I hope you're as sweaty as I am. <laughs> Have a great day. Bye, guys.